Okay, if you do two seconds of research into the bill, I'm not American, but I actually did two seconds of research into the bill. Um, it has nothing to do with stopping people from saying gay. It has everything to do with uh, preventing children from being sexualized at a young age. Um, you know, kids should be learning their ABCs, you know, one, two, threes, colors, math, you know, how to be a good, good general human, how to be good to each other. You know, maybe even how to use the bathroom properly. Some kids. The, the whole bill is that children don't need to know about masturbation and touching themselves. It's not, I don't, I don't believe, they don't need to know about that right away. Right? That, that, this, don't do that. Hey, you know, you're not bad. There's nothing wrong. But just don't do that because there are other things you need to be prioritizing with your, with your time. Like learning your ABCs, becoming a good member of society, helping your friends, being constructive, being creative. All right? But now the schools want to take time out of being constructive, being creative, being a good member of society to educate children about how and when and what to do to touch their PPs and their vajayjays and their what color what colors if they're interested in one color they should pursue one color if they like pink a lot they should pursue pink if they like if they're a girl and like blue a lot they should pursue pursue blue but let's not consider the fact that if you is blue and blue okay is pink and pink okay i don't know what are the, what are they it that why does it matter to a child when their the main priority should be one, two, three, A, B, C, all the colors of the rainbow, you know, nobody, the, the, the sexualization the, of the, you know what I mean? They don't need to know about their, the, the PP is for peeing, the vagina is for peeing, the butts are for pooing. End of story. That's the, that, there's your sexual class as a child. That's your sex ed. You pee out of your pee hole, you poo out of your butthole. You wipe your butt after you poo, pee, do it in the toilet. Okay, they don't need to know, oh, when you touch here, it feels good. When you shove a cucumber, <laughs> like, you know what I mean? That's what they're trying to teach fucking four-year-olds and six-year-olds six year and ten-year-olds. Like, what? It's hard enough. The education system we established from caveman times is hard enough to get together. And now you're trying to push this other shit that is it has no business where in in school that's what the don't say gay bill but this is what people hear this is what people think don't say gay don't say as the first two words in a sentence spoken by a political leader of a state in the united states of america don't say don't fucking say you fucking nazi pig Say, First Amendment, read about it, then run for office, you piece of shit. <laughs> Good morning, Governor DeSantis. <laughs> like, what the fuck? No elaboration, just, just gets bad, and then all these people are like, yeah, you go, girl, 100%, 10 out of 10, <laughs> king. What are, are these people mentally ill? He hasn't said anything. He sounded wasted. He's like, uh, yeah, DeSantis, don't say gay. He says, don't say. You guys hear what he said? He said, don't say gay. Don't read into the bill and read what it says. Just like the bills that we were passing. All you got to do is do a surface level skim. Hear, hear the, the two first paragraphs of what we want to do and you believe it. We're good to go. I appreciate it. I don't miss he's or fucking after all. It's the same. Here in Germany with those conservatives, they all close their eyes and don't see it. See what? Education is crucial for the fight. Germans are the worst. Germans are the worst perpetrators of sexualizing children. They've, they had to come out recently because the church, like, there was a school that was doing experiments and they were handing, the church was involved. There was a bunch of molestations of the church and there was another thing where there was a psychological experiment or some social experiment where they're giving children out to sexual predators they're allowing them to 
care for chose it was it's fucked up it was really really messed up they admitted it they went back on it like it was hard enough to establish the system that we have now you know what i mean where people get adopted you have to if you, if you want to adopt children you have to go through this huge huge vetting process you know what i mean it's hard enough to establish you know the educational system that we have right now that we had now it's just a it was a meritocracy now it's just an absolute shit show I mean, you still could learn a lot of stuff in school but I'm just saying you're better off using the internet and just keep learning yourself if you're able to um, read and sit down and absorb knowledge. Just tutor and even without, even if you can't read and absorb knowledge, just sitting down you can watch YouTube videos. Like, and if worse comes to worse, you know, get a job, buy hire a tutor. I don't know. Let's see, what do you want to talk to five year olds about sex? Exactly, that's what the bill is. Look at this age restricted adult content. This. This might not be appropriate for people under 18. They blocked this guy's message. What's his message? Why do you want to talk to five-year-olds about sex? Because that's a, that's exactly what the question is. That's what the bill is against. Is, you never read. <laughs> Slay Kang. <laughs> that guy just jerked him. Uh, but this is Ron, the Ron Perlman jokes. I don't know if you've ever seen the memes. They're so funny. Ron Perlman, once he made a comment about Trump and how... He went to shake Trump's hand and he didn't wash his hand after he like took a piss or something. And he's like, how do you like that, Trump? <laughs> People started making these exaggerated fucking Ron Perlman posts where he like shits himself or he covers himself in shit and then like <laughs> thinks that he's a fucking hot guy because he does he can't practice personal hygiene and he thinks that not practicing personal hygiene and then rubbing his hands all over people that he doesn't like is a cool and we're supposed to assume that he doesn't touch anyone else that he does like or anyone else in his family or he doesn't regularly not wash his hands after he takes a piss real cool ron really good stance <laughs> you got you got trump there ron. Uh, this is fucking i love ron perlin says what's on his mind <laughs> i feel mentally ill Mom mentality at its best. All you read about the bill is clearly the headlines. Yeah, all you read is don't take it. So none of these idiots get it. Could take 20 minutes to read it, yet they have hours to swear to complain online. <laughs> yeah, right. He hasn't read it more than he, he needs a shower. <laughs> Shouldn't even be the bill on the committee. It's sad. Yeah, TV doesn't mean you are. Yeah, really. Ugh, what a guy. Jeez. Yeah, read the bill. Read the bill. Yeah, read the bill.